What's up guys? In this tutorial, I will show you how to enable the back button on your Android device. With the evolution of Android interfaces, many devices have moved towards gesture controls for navigation. However, some users find the tactile feedback of a back button more intuitive and miss the straightforwardness it offers for navigating through apps and pages. Whether it's a matter of preference or ease of use, bringing back the traditional navigation buttons, including the back button, is something many users are looking for. To begin, open the Settings app. The quickest way to find what you're looking for is by using the search bar at the top of the Settings menu. Type System Navigation and select the result that comes up. Once you're on the System Navigation page, you'll likely see a few options available on how you can navigate your device. These options typically include Gesture Navigation, which has become the default for many new Android devices and versions. However, what we're interested in is switching to the three-key navigation system. This setting brings back the traditional navigation bar at the bottom of your screen, complete with the Home, Back and Recent Apps buttons. Selecting the three-key navigation option will immediately apply the change and you should now see the navigation bar with the Back button appear at the bottom of your screen. This change will stay in effect across all apps and screens providing a consistent navigation experience that many users find more straightforward and accessible. And that's pretty much all there is to it. You've now successfully enabled the back button on your Android device, making it easier to navigate through your phone or tablet using a more traditional and familiar method. I hope this helped you out. Leave a comment if you have any questions and see you in the next one.